Natasha. Yes, mommy. When are you going to dress like this? Um, how is that your business? Hello. What did you just say? How is that your business, mommy? Excuse you. Of course, it is my business. How? Where are you going to dress up like this? Come on, mommy. I need to. I go. only ask you a simple question, my dear. Have you forgotten where you are coming from? Oh, please, man, don't start again. I'm talking to you right now. Oh, please, mommy. Go okay. back there and change you know, I'm not your dressing. Go. I'm not going to go back there. We both know it. I have to go. Come on, I'm already late right now. Don't let me give you a dirty slap. I'm only giving you a oh, warning. Please, please, please. This is an African woman. The way and manner you are dressed right now is so irresponsible. Why are you always preaching? That's the problem. You're always preaching, preaching, and preaching. Let me go, please. Are you out of your mind? <laughs> are you trying to tell the world that your mother and your father are irresponsible? I gave you a very proper training. You want to let the men know that you are a prostitute? The way you dress is exactly the way men will address you. Come on, mommy. This is training. The way you dress is exactly the kind of men that will approach you. You are telling me that this is 21st century. I don't care. This is an African home, my dear. Still go up there and change your dress immediately. This is the 21st century. Why do you want me to dress like you, like an old lady? Ah, you don't want to dress like that. Mm, dress like an old lady. And I, a matured mind will find you as a husband. You dress like this, and it's only those men who are useless, who are careless, who would make use of you. Because you are telling them, oh, I am available to be make, to be used. I am available to be used. I am available to be used. Men, come. That is exactly the same line you are bringing out there. That you are available to be used and dumped. Then afterwards, you start crying that men made you a single mother. The ones that are even dressing up properly. They are still frustrating them. Let alone, according to my father, he said, the people they prayed for, life is still hard for them. Let alone the people that are cursed. My dear, it's not fair. Go back inside and change your dressing. Yeah, mommy, come on. Oh, you are taking time, right? <laughs> no, Wahala. I talk too much. Don't leave this house. I'm coming for you. What is wrong with this woman? Always complaining every time. Pitchy, 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 pitchy. change your dress go back inside and change this rag you are putting on right now for clothes <laughs> children of these days new generation new gen z new gen z what is going on i am not interested in all this so-called new gen z children are going out naked not even half naked anymore. It's not acceptable in an African home. And you should know that better. Go and put on something nice. Idiot. Mommy, is this one okay? Can I go now? <laughs> My dear, I know you are not happy. But this is one of the reasons why you have a mother. And also the reason why so many people who doesn't have mother even cry. Because of such correction. This is good. Dress properly. The way you dress is exactly the way people address you. If you dress like a prostitute, people will call you just like a dog. That is how they approach you. And when they are able to get you, 
they also treat you like a trash. They suck you like an orange. Once they realize that there is no longer fruit in you, they throw you in the bin. It is not their fault. It is exactly the signal you give out there. Please, my dear, dress beautiful. Dress responsible. Okay? Yes, mommy. How do you feel now dressed this way? It's not better. It's okay. Don't you feel more comfortable? At least everywhere is covered. You are still sexy, but everywhere is covered.